Today is December 18th. <clears throat> this is a different uh, kind of thread or topic for me to talk about, but uh, I was just thinking about the uh, stories from the Bible of the, was it the Titans, God sent, I don't know, the, the, yeah, they were tasked with cutting down the trees, supposed to come to earth or cut down the trees for some reason, so apparently, you know, God wanted to have the trees cut down, and I was thinking about that, and in a sense, you could think of uh, the trees kind of being a metaphor for the people. Because, you know, each tree is an individual, but all the trees together make a forest. And each person's an individual, but as a, as a total, we are, you know, the, the forest of humanity. You know? We're, we're the, you know, like a forest in a way, and each one of us is an individual. But I was thinking about the logic of that. Uh, if you ask most people, I think, is God logical? They would say, yes, of course God's logical. Look how nature is interdependent upon other things in nature. Without one, this other one you know, can't be, and vice versa. And so there's a, a logical you know, connection between living things and their environment. and. And that's part of this created realm that we're in, which is created. Uh, you know, creation implies a creator, and I'm not going to speculate on the exact nature of the creator, and he certainly doesn't have a name. I believe it's uh, similar to like the beginning of the Tao, where it says the Tao that can be named is not the true Tao just to replace Tao with God. The God that can be named is not the true God. Once us with our small, limited understanding and awareness of things, if we think that we can put a name on something we've identified and labeled it, that's a bit arrogant because um, you know, we don't know the mind or, of God. Uh, and... Uh, to think that we could say that's God or here's God or God's over there or, this is God's name that's kind of a, a logical fallacy in a way or something if that's the right term because um, we're trying to label God and God is everything you can't you can't take everything that could possibly be in your perception in the entire universe which is the world and say that's one the one thing. I mean, you could say it, but you'd have to say, well, that's God. The, the, you know, the, the, the trees are God. The, the road is God. The air is God. The, the idea of thinking about things and having a mind is God. You can't name everything and call it one thing. Everything is not a single thing. Everything, the sum total of it, represents the mind and creation of God in a sense, so I don't think he can name God, but uh, so the trees sends down the sends the titans out to cut down the trees and I was thinking in a logical sense, why? why would that make any sense? God creates, you know, takes the